Alex, this is the fourth time you've played Rafa. You played him here, actually, in 2020, and you played him close. But this is the first time you've beaten him. How'd you do it? Huh. Honestly, <clears throat> I couldn't be happier that I managed to get my first win over Rafa on this court in front of you guys, because you guys are... I think there's no secret that this is my favorite court in the entire world, so thank you guys very much. But yeah, I, I knew it was going to be a battle. Uh, Rafa's a hell of a competitor, and what he's been able to do for this sport is truly astounding, so I'm just honored and uh, you know, it's a dream come true being able to beat him on court, so very happy with that. He's known as one of the great fighters in, in any sport, let alone tennis. He's tough to finish off. What was Leighton telling you before the last sit-down when you came out? What were you thinking as you wanted to try and finish this match off? Well, as you're trying to serve that out, it's completely natural to have all these different scenarios coming in your head, but I tried to think as little as possible. I just said to myself, see ball, hit ball, and it worked out. I was able to serve probably the best game I've served all match, so I'll definitely take that. That looks like a new tactic has been formed. Well done. You're obviously in great shape. You've done a lot of work in the offseason. You look ready to make an assault at the Australian Open. How do you feel like your form and your fitness is as you look ahead to that event? Yeah, I can't wait. Can't wait for the Aussie summer. Um, it's the best time of the year. Hopefully I can do Australia proud and play some good tennis uh, over the next coming weeks and uh, hope to see you all out there. All right, last question. You've been amazing when playing for the green and gold and playing for Australia. Phenomenal. How do you like this new United Cup, this brand new format with the men and women playing together? Look, honestly, whenever I get a chance to play for Australia, uh, I'm a true believer in there being no greater honor than representing your country. So every time there's an opportunity, I'll put my hand up and I love doing it. I love playing for Australia and I'll keep doing it with a smile on my face. All right, you put your hand up. Let's put our hands together for Alex Diminor.